they smell weird. I don't know, I'm gonna have to rinse this off. But yeah, you can Yeah, I love cheap stuff. Welcome back to my channel. So I ordered a ton of stuff from Miss A. I've been eyeing it for a while. If you're not familiar with Miss A, it's basically um, a website that has almost everything on the website for a dollar. There's a couple things on there that cost more than a dollar, but it's mainly beauty products on there. Here's my package. So I'm so excited. I think I got about 30 items. I paid about $35. I am a sucker for cheap stuff because you can find some quality things um, for low prices so that was the point of me ordering all this stuff and I'm excited to share it with y'all and let's get into it okay okay so I'm gonna go ahead and open this up it's just it came in like one of those plastic mailer bags and then of course everything is surrounded by this and I'm dropping stuff out of mine um so I'm gonna go ahead and open it up So here's like a little shot of everything that I got. I could barely fit it all on the table. Got some jewelry, bath bombs, some um, silicone sponges, some concealers, and some lipsticks. Yeah. Okay, so First and foremost, I got this makeup bag. Um, so let me go ahead and tell you, um, Miss A does have their own brand. It's called AOA, and I think they also have another one called like A2O or something like that. Um, but they have their own brands on there, amongst other brands like LA Colors and other things like that that you can order from, as well as cheap and in the same price range. Um, so a good amount of this stuff is the AOA brand because I was really interested to see how their brand would be the quality of the product and everything like that so the first thing I got was this goals makeup bag it's a cute little makeup bag I'm probably just gonna put all the lipsticks that I bought in because I honestly can't have enough makeup bags because I have a good amount of makeup um, I'm trying to see what it's made out of it doesn't say what it's made out of but I like the what it's made out of it's cute. I mean, it says hashtag goals. Like, what girl doesn't want this? Um, so next, I'm going to actually do like the lipstick swatches and the concealer swatches last so I can get this other stuff out the way. So I got a couple skincare items. So I got a coconut. I got the coconut oil um, facial sheet mask. And I also got the green tea mask. The coconut oil is supposed to be a hydrating mask while the green tea one is supposed to be purifying. I can't wait to try these. I love skincare and like masks and stuff like that. So let me know if y'all want a video on that or a review on these because I will do one for you. I also got this oatmeal oxygen bubble mask and they got me a bubble mask. I'm like, bubble mask, that sounds like cool as shit. So I want to try it. <laughs> so this is what it looks like. It was, I'm pretty sure a dollar. I think the only thing that I bought that wasn't a dollar was the um, bath bombs. And yes, they have bath bombs. They're called F bombs. <laughs> um, so yeah, this came with two treatments of the bubble mask. And it's supposed to clean and brighten your skin. I'm really excited. For that, I also bought a charcoal nose strip to remove like heads and dirt from my nose. I know y'all have seen those little weird videos of people like ripping like all that nasty stuff out of their nose. So I wanted to see if this would be similar. And yeah, this one is actually by the A2O brand that I was telling you about. I think the skincare is under A2O. So I'm really excited. Again, let me know if y'all want a video about the skincare. And then I think that was all I had for skincare. So next, I got a couple sponges, like blenders, etc. So, let's take this out. The first thing I got from them is their Wonder Blender. I mean, this is just the packaging that comes in. And it's black. This is the exact same 
This is the exact same shape as the Real Technique sponge, so I'm thinking I might love it. Spongy. Um, it doesn't feel hard. I hate when I get beauty sponges that are hard, because hard or rubbery. I hate the rubbery. Um, but yeah, it's pretty soft. Looking forward to trying it out. It seems like it would be comfortable to the Real Techniques, and it was only a dollar. So I got another Wonder Blender, but it was a it's a different color. I mean, a different shape. My bad. So this one, the other one I got is just in the teardrop shape. So I just got two of each. Well, one of each. Firm seems to be promising. Okay, so something that has been like the latest crave right now, or the latest rage right now with beauty influencers and makeup junkies and everybody are those silly sponges, Scylla sponges, the silicone sponges for blending. And I never bought any, but when I was on um, MissA.com, I see that their AOA brand actually has some. So I decided to get it. So I got two of the Wonder Jelly. Um, they call them Wonder Jelly sponges, blending sponge. Let's see that. So, this one has glitter. It's so weird. They smell weird. Oh no, I'm gonna have to rinse this off. But yeah, you can see it. This one has glitter in it. Can you see that? Okay, yeah. So this one has glitter in it. Oh my god, this is my first time like touching a silicone sponge. And I must admit, they are weird as fuck. Okay, so that one had glitter, and then this one is just a different shade. I'm not gonna take it out, but it's just wider. But yeah, I'm definitely gonna start um, trying these out because I know most people didn't like the silicone sponges, but I wanna try it out. So I got four sponges for $4. Okay, so next, I guess I can just mention this. I got like these little cute tweezers. You can never have enough tweezers and they're black. I love black stuff. It's just so like chic to me. So I got those. Move Jack. Oh, I got some LA Colors Pout Lip Gloss. And I got this because it says Pout Lip Gloss Matte. So it says it's matte. It's saying that it's matte, but it's lip gloss. And I just don't feel like something could be matte and lip gloss at the same time. So I'm gonna just like swatch it on my hand first. So that's the color, it's pretty. It kind of reminds me of like a mauve, but more pink and the consistency reminds me of the NYX Soft Lip Creams, honestly, but a little bit, little bit more moisturizing. I'm going to see if it's going to dry matte. How about I just go ahead and put some on? I'm going to just let it sit and see if it gets matte. Because on my hand, it's dry matte. So maybe it's called a, lip, a matte lip gloss because it come, goes on as lip gloss and dries matte. We'll see. It's already dry. It's, so it dry kind of fast. And if you look at my hand, it's pretty dry. So nice. I might get me more of these depending on how I like it. Next, I got two chokers. So I got this denim choker. And I got this. I don't know if they call this one, but this one is really cute. So let's try on this one. So basically this is what it looks like. I can't get it closed. Like this, these run very small. Like look at that. The um, chain is not um, that long. Like I feel like it'll fit around my neck, but barely. Like I'm gonna have to put it in that last little notch. And I know chokers are supposed to be tight, but that's not very like fitting for everybody. So I'm not gonna try this one on, but I think it's really cute. And we're getting down to the concealers and stuff. I have a couple more things. So, told you I got two body bombs. This is one of them. It's 
smells good. So as you see, it says F bum, bum on the front of it. These were two fifty, if I remember correctly. So two fifty for a bath bomb is nice. I've never used one or bought one before, so I'm excited to see how that works out. So I have two. Okay, and then I also ordered. What's this? Oh, I I ordered a LA Colors contour stick. Well, it's a highlight stick. So you can see here. And I wanted to see if it compares with um, the Burberry highlighting stick that I have. Because if it do, then dupe alert. Okay. Let me get this off. Has anybody tried this before? So I know it's a Miss A haul, but I got some extra stuff. But most of it is from Miss A. Okay, so this is what the stick looks like. Let's watch it. Oh, that's pretty nice. So. You can see it right there. I swatched it. So this would be good for like a, I would say everyday glow, because it's not like popping, but it's pigmented. Like you can see it from back here. I can see that being like, yeah, like a natural. Just like, yeah, it's like a natural highlight. Something to throw on when you're going to like class or like, you don't feel like being your face, but you don't want to be basic either. This is for you. Not be my face, but want to be. Don't want to be basic. <laughs> One dollar. And yeah, this one's by LA Colors. LA Colors is low-key lit, though. I see. Okay, so one more thing from LA Colors. Actually, what's this one? Two more things from LA Colors. I got a auto lip liner in mauve. Because, I mean, lip liners are cheap anyway, for the most part. Unless you go to Mac and spend, like, $15 on one. So this one is, like... To kind of you twist up honestly it's going to be a little bit more creamy but it is like super matte so it's for here it's a pretty it's like a true mauve color i could see myself using this and i really like the auto ones because you don't have to keep sharpening it over and over and over and over again i hate that and then I got, okay, I'm pretty sure. I don't know how this is going to work for me, but I got the LA Colors Liquid Makeup, and I got it in, like, the darkest color, I think. Or well, maybe last the darkest color. And basically, I'm just going to, I'm going to try to do, like, a $1 makeup tutorial in the future, but I got this one, and this in the shade Beautiful Bronze. I don't know if that's the darkest one. I think that's the second to darkest one, but, yeah, I got it. And I want to like try it out on my face, like, and do a tutorial. I'm a little nervous. Okay, so I came out. Let's see that on there. Whoa. Um, I got to see that. So this is what I didn't blend it in. You can see like. That's how it is when you blend it in. It gets thin. But I can see like once it dries that you can probably like build on top of it. But yeah. I have a AOA, the Miss A brand studio poreless primer. I'm looking forward to trying that. Like this it on this hand. Okay, I'm gonna show y'all. It's like pretty watery. Just right out. And then it's so smooth it's like almost it just blends out to like nothing it doesn't feel silicone at all like how the NYX one and the Smashbox one does it actually feels hydrating and it smells good which is good but I just I'm kind of concerned as to if it actually works as a primer because it's so thin and it just absorbs like that so we'll see I'll definitely be doing a review on this one 
So all of these concealers had the same names as the LA Girl Pro Conceal, which is already very affordable and very, very good. So I was just interested to see how they compare. I actually have a couple of these colors. We have Warm Honey, Espresso, Chestnut, Fawn, Cool Tan, which is my favorite, and Toast. But yeah, I'll just swatch Cool Tan on my arm, I guess. The packaging looks like ColourPop Glow 6. Very light, you can tell it's plastic and cheap. Okay, so. It doesn't really have a smell. Let's see. Look at that coverage. It's crazy. It looks like the same amount of coverage as the LA Girl Pro. Oh my god, what if I have a $1 dupe to the LA Girl Pro? Y'all. Yeah, make sure y'all tune into that video. I'll um, put a link down below to that video as well once I upload this one. Because this is about to be lit. Yes. And then they're the same colors. I'm so freaking excited. Okay, so let's move on. To the lipsticks. Like I said, I'm not going to swatch them. I'll probably do a separate video for these two. Because I don't want this video to be super, super long. But I got six lipsticks as well. From Miss A. Oh my god. I'll just show y'all the colors. Some of them are metallic. Okay, so here's the purple. Just gonna take it and hold on. I ain't gonna lie, they used to like paint a little bit. There we go how pigmented and pretty that is it's such a pretty purple i love lipstick like dark lipstick so i'm here for it so pretty i'm excited to swatch the other ones but yeah um that's basically everything guys thanks for watching my video let me know have y'all shopped at miss day before because it's my first time but based on some of this stuff i'm probably gonna shop again because i'm cheap and why not um, I might do another haul if y'all interested in that then let me know and just comment down below Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see y'all next time. All right now. Bye. -bye.